I don't know if you've noticed or not, but uh, have you have you seen my have you noticed my hat? It's an Atlanta Brave hat. They they are in the World Series, and I can't be any more proud. Uh, we've already completed three games. Atlanta has taken two of those games, and uh, and the Astros took one at home in Houston, which. Uh, it's cool. I'm not a big Houston fan, and I know a lot of people have a problem with them because they were cheating. Uh, I think they were – I don't fully remember what they were doing, but I think they were, like, stealing, like, signals. Or, you know, they 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 would somehow know what the pitcher is pitching, and so they'd know how to handle that ball. And that kind of pissed a lot of people off. But why do I care so much? Well, uh, I've been an Atlanta Brave fan since – since probably 1982 and and because TBS you know Atlanta Braves was the baseball team in Virginia where I'm from and uh, I just watched them from then on and there's been times where I've not really paid so much attention and I actually got to go see uh, game two of the World Series back when they played the Cleveland Indians back in 1995 and that was super fun but another reason why it matters to me is because I was actually employed by the Atlanta Braves. I worked for their AAA team uh, in Gwinnett, uh, for the Gwinnett Braves, and then they switched over to Gwinnett Stripers, which was, you know, the AAA farm team for Atlanta Braves. So a lot of the people that are even on this team right now, I got to, I got the pleasure of, you know, working, you know, beside of and, and oh, I, I shot a. I was I was a videographer. I uh, was able to shoot video for these games, which was a lot of fun. And I worked with a lot of really great people. And uh, some of those people went on, and they they're working for the Atlanta Braves in Atlanta. And uh, I know somebody who does the audio, and uh, she did a fantastic job. You know, I heard her last night working. She did a really good job. And I know some guys that do you know, video work on the field. And, uh, it was, it's just really fun. Uh, but another thing I want to talk about real quick about the Atlanta Braves is a lot of people are very quickly having a problem with the name Braves. And I don't, I I know this is just kind of the culture we're in. Everybody gets butthurt about a lot of things, but I needed you to understand if, if you care, if you don't care, then that's fine. You know, this might be just an interesting little fact here. But if you do care and you you get offended by the name Braves, you have to understand the Atlanta Braves, the organization, works very closely with the Native Americans in the area. And the Native Americans in the area, take they, they love the fact that the Braves are called the Braves. They have basically signed off on the name and they've signed off on the Tomahawk Chalk. They think they're very proud that they are being, that they're being, um, glorified, you know, on, on this gigantic stage for everybody to see. Now what's happening, you've got a lot of people who think it's a bad thing and they shouldn't be, you know, that they're being made fun of, but, uh, the native Americans don't see it this way. They, they love this. Actually, you may not know this, but my wife is half native American. So, you know, if uh, I think we would have, we would be one of the people that would be butthurt about this if there was a reason to be butthurt about it, but there's not. Uh, they, uh, they, the, the Braves organization takes their name seriously and uh, it's not derogatory and they see it as a, a very good thing where they're, you know, holding up these, the, these, you know, Native Americans on a pedestal and saying, you know what, these people need to be celebrated. And that's what that is. It's a celebration of the Native Americans. Not We're not laughing at them. And they know we're not. And they appreciate it. The Native Americans in the Atlanta area, and it may be more than just the Atlanta area, know that this is, this is a celebration of them. And that's it. That's all there is. So, you know, I see other names. Um, I, I can I can see other particular names, you know, like maybe Redskins. I can see why that one got taken away. It's it's you can't really do much with that. That's they it needs to be changed. I'm okay with that. But the Braves, it's not derogatory and it's it's a good thing. It's a real good thing. But so if you're one of those people who consider it, who gets offended by it, because there's you know there's a journalist who won't even say the word. 
you know, when they write their stories or people on TV, you know, news people who won't say the word Braves because they have decided for the Native Americans that it's derogatory and the Native Americans are like, what's wrong with you? We're, we're okay with this. This is great. We're being celebrated. Stop it. Stop it. Anyway, that's what's on my mind. Glad that you can stay with me and uh, let me know. But if you have a particular idea about what you think about the name Atlanta Braves, let me know. I mean, you know, you, you, I don't know if people want to put themselves out there like that. And, uh, you know, it's a little bit more political. And that's fine. If you don't want to comment, that's fine. Um, but maybe I'll, you know what I'll do? I'll put a poll out on Facebook, or not Facebook, but uh, YouTube. And I'll say, uh, and maybe it'll be worded like, are you offended by the name Atlanta Braves? And then that's, you can you can say yes or no, and nobody's going to know who you are. Because I, I, I definitely want anybody being uncomfortable, you know, saying one way or the other. I don't care. I'm very proud of Native Americans. I'm very proud of my life. So, so that's it. All right. Thanks for listening. I appreciate it. See you guys next time.